Hello everyone, I'm Watson. In this video, we're going to talk about an application for an unmanaged PoE switch. So an unmanaged PoE switch, we all know that the PoE switch act as the data exchange center for a network system. And a PoE switch is one of the things we use most commonly in like a small network system for like IP surveillance cameras. So in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to set up this IP surveillance camera system with a PoE switch. So, let's talk about some benefits of an unmanaged PoE switch. Well, the unmanaged PoE switch, first, it's plug and play device. This means all we need to do is plug the Ethernet cables in the correct spots and then connect that Ethernet cable to an IP device, like the IP camera. And in that case, everything will be done. We don't need to configure anything and the whole device will work on its own. Now, let's talk about some advantages of an unmanaged PoE switch. Well, the unmanaged PoE switch is a plug and play device. This means all we need to do is plug the Ethernet cable to the correct spots on the PoE switch. And on the other end of the Ethernet cable, we connect it to the IP PoE devices, like this IP surveillance camera. And in this case, everything will be set and we don't have to do any configuration. Secondly, it's less expensive. Comparing to one of those managed PoE switches, the unmanaged PoE switch is not that expensive. The price is much more lower, so our budget will be lower as well. And then it provides us a lot of convenience because a PoE switch can just use the PoE switch for power and data. The PoE technology transmits power and data as a combined signal to the IP device. And all we need is the Ethernet cable. If we use like regular network switches, they are cheap as well, but we're going to have to need to provide power separately. A PoE switch will do all the job with just one single Ethernet cable. So now let's talk about the procedure of setting up an IP surveillance camera system with an unmanaged PoE switch. To do so, we're going to need a monitor that's going to help us, you know, set the channels and set all those cameras in the correct spots. Then we're going to need an NVR. The NVR is a network video recorder. It receives the footage the video footage as the data package and it will help us record it down on the hard disk drives and show it on the screens. And then it's the PoE switch, the unmanaged PoE switch here. We just need to connect it to the NVR. And remember the NVR connects to the uplink port and then the other, other ports, the other PoE ports, we're gonna connect to our IP cameras. It's not that hard, right? Now let's take a look on how we do it actually. I'm gonna walk you through the steps. I'm gonna just use one camera here, but most often you can connect as many cameras as you want to all the ports, but make sure you got, get your power budget right. Now we have our monitor connected to the NVR. We're gonna use the ethernet cable connected to the NVR and plug it in the uplink port of our PoE switch. And then we're gonna use another ethernet cable connect it to our PoE switch as well. And this one will go to one of these PoE ports. And the other end will go to our IP camera. And then you will see the image will show on our screen shortly. All right, now you see we have the image of our camera on our screen. This means this whole connection is set up. And for more cameras, all we needed to do is to use the Ethernet to connect to the camera and it will show on the screen as well. And you can set it in all the different channels. It's really easy. That's the benefit of a plug and play device. All right, that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys have any more questions, feel free to leave them at the section below. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.